Hi students, good morning. My name is Samuel Chuku Emeka, as usual. In this video session, we shall graph and trace functions using the uh, TI-84+. Plus. So, let's open this up. Uh, please, I recommend that you uh, that you view the videos in order. Uh, this video uh, is a playlist. It's part of a playlist on a TI eighty four tutorials. So it it is great if you uh, view this in order. We are going to use uh, the examples we did in the previous video on making a table of values we are going to use that and uh, we are going to do some examples from here remember what i uh, explained in the previous video if you have your function like this you will have to make it to be like this before you can uh, graph it so uh, let's like do example one number one y equal to 2x minus 1 and that is a linear function so what we want to do is we press this function y equal to and uh, we we have a 2x minus 1 so uh, there are two things you can do to uh, draw the graph for this function you can either uh, go ahead and uh, press graph and uh, it will show you the graph or uh, th this is the graph in a normal viewing window uh, the graph as you will see it in a normal viewing window in a normal view or in a in a normal window on your calculator uh, if you don't want to press the graph or if you don't have graph you can also uh, press zoom and uh, when you put this zoom uh, you have these uh, options uh, one is z box two is zoom in three is zoom out four is z decimal and the rest of them uh, later on we can explain this one at a time in other videos but if you want to see this graph in a normal viewing window just like you see it when you press graph, you press 6. So this is the same thing. Okay, it's the same thing. So you either press a uh, zoom 6 or you go to this function and you press graph. Okay, whether you press this, uh, if you press it, uh, graph or you press zoom 6. Is it is the same thing let's go to tracing because sometimes you might be asked to uh, trace your graph to a particular value uh, you, let's say uh, the, the question will say uh, from your graph what is a uh, y when x is a uh, 5 or what is y when x is a uh, 5.3 something like that so uh you know sometimes you'll be required to trace your graph if they ask you uh, that kind of questions or another thing they might ask you is uh, what is the uh, x and y intercept that is another thing you might be asked so uh, in such cases you will know how to trace it so that you, uh, you, you you can also look at your table of values for some of the uh, graphs depending on the function they give you you can trace it using your table of values uh, but it is also good if you know how to trace it from your graph so if you want to trace this graph you just click trace and when you uh, when you click trace you now see it uh, is blinking here that when x is 0 y is negative 1 so you can either use the uh, the uh, right arrow cursor key 
on your keyboard you can do that or you just press this to trace it gives you the trace now there is something we notice here in the trace and uh, the trace is not uniform you see this is uh, when x is 2.1276596 you press it again it is 2.3404255 the trace is not uniform so how do you make this trace to be uniform so what you have to do is you go to zoom and you you press z4 the four up no, option number four z decimal you press it and when you press it you can now press trace and then you see now the trace is uh, uniform uh, in uh, increments of 0 0.1 the trace is now uniform so it will kind of give you a clearer uh, 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 it will kind of give you uh, more definite values all right uh, let's do one more and let's do number seven absolute value of x minus three so we come here we can clear this uh, we click mat uh, num press option one absolute value of x press this uh, minus three and then we can either press graph or we go to uh, zoom six i usually like using this zoom uh, six and if you want to trace it we press trace but it is not uniform you see the x values and the, uh, the x values are not uniform so how do we make it uniform we go to zoom we press 4 and then we press trace and hence we can now get a uniform tracing all right please watch out for more videos in this playlist as i mentioned earlier please follow this in order so that you don't miss any uh, important details thank you and have a great day